Okay, so the TV show starts off. You, you know, you and uh, you and Big Meech are doing your thing, and then suddenly there's a knock on the door, and Lamar shows up. And this is your ex who had been in prison for a while. That was kind of the stepdaddy of your daughter, and he's trying to get back in your life. Um, and then a whole big mess starts to form out of this whole situation. Um, what did you personally think about this kind of interaction? Because you have this, you know, on the show, you have this guy who wants to be the father of your daughter, but he's not actually the biological father. What is your take on this in terms of how you got into the role and how you feel this has developed? You know what? I just felt like it was, you know, I'm like, it's acting. I'm like, I'm acting as if I'm her. The only thing like we got in common is I'm from Detroit and she a player. I'm like, nah, it's cool with me. I mean, I feel like it's real life situations. This type of stuff happens all the time. You know, a lot of people ain't that vocal about it, but a lot of people is. And it's all over the Internet. But I ain't really feel no type of way. I just felt like that was her story and I'm not going to judge her. <laughs> it just is what it is. I'm here to play your part for you, girl. Do you. <laughs> well, the thing about the, the BMF story is that it really is based on real it's, people. It's, you know? it's real so people. And, and like, I'm cool with the lady daughter that I play. And, 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 actu- and in, in reality, the lady... She's not here no more. Oh. Yeah, so I play her. Her, I'm cool with her daughter. You know, I'm, I, I talk to her family, and everybody's okay with the story. Nobody really had any issues. I just, you know, played the part. But, you know, a lot of stuff, it, a lot of it is real, and then, you know, they make it good for TV. They do their little tweaks or whatever like that, but it's, it makes it a little more entertaining for sure. Well, yeah, but but like I said, they do their tweaks and, and things are a little different. But the the characters, like you know, I've I've interviewed a lot of the characters. Like you know, oh, okay. I, I interviewed Wood Harris's character in real life. Right, I, and that's I, why I you didn't interview my girl because she passed back then. She passed away oh, exactly. Heroin. And um, okay, so at the end of the first season, uh, Lamar gets killed, or so we think, by Big Meech. And, and I remember in between the first and second season. I actually located the real Lamar, mm. who is Laden Beast Simon. Yeah. Who is still alive. Right. Now, I don't know whether this is true or not, but I, I feel like that interview was the reason why he got brought back in season two. <laughs> like, after I put that interview out. No, they already knew they was bringing him back. Oh, they already knew it? Yeah, okay. they already knew All he was right. bringing him back. It was just making, you know, it was just like, it was a good way to end it, of course. You know, to think that he's actually dead. The problem of the show, to actually think he's dead, that was a good way to end that. And then for him to come back, not even a first episode, but like second, third episode, it's like, yeah. Mm-hmm. And then that's when I come back. <laughs> right. Mm-hmm. So in season two, you find out that Lamar actually survives, but he has a shit bag. Yeah. And he shows up to your house. Yes, he, of course he did. And shows you the shit bag. <laughs> Of course he did. So I'm, I'm, I'm thinking that you know we're still kind of halfway through the season. I mean, you probably can't say nothing because I'm sure you signed lots of forms. But d- does Monique and Lamar end up having sex with, with a shit bag at some point? <laughs> he, he he can't even get hard. <laughs> uh okay. Oh yeah, with the big girl. Okay, I remember that. Yeah. Scene. So how we have sex? Okay. All right. Well, fair <laughs> enough. Because the shit bag seems to be a very like a theme that goes throughout this the series. To the, remember, remember he ended up killing that one guy and ended up opening the shit bag on him, and it was just like, oh, oh yeah, disgusting. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's trifling. That's trifling. Yeah, Lamar. It's trifling. Ophie. You're nasty. Yeah. 